Hi, I'm Thomas with RF Elements, and I will introduce the starter dish antennas designed for 5 GHz unlicensed bands. Our starter series antennas are great entry-level products to ease into RF Elements technology. They offer the best RF performance and all the essential functionality at an incredibly competitive pricing. If you want to know how to assemble and install these antennas, check our unboxing video by clicking the link in the corner or in the video description. What are the RF features of the Star Dish antennas? Their radiation pattern is highly directional, and with the growing size, their gain is growing and the beam width is shrinking. Thanks to the highly directional radiation pattern, Star Dish antennas are ideal as a CPE antenna to connect the clients. The three gain options let you connect customers within a large span of distances. The Star Dish antennas are designed for high performance in heavily noisy areas. The minimized side lobes diminish the noise the radio sees, resulting in high throughput. Reduced size of the side lobes ensures that the antenna receives and transmits the signal only from the desired directions, protecting your network from the RF noise, the number one problem of unlicensed 5 GHz networks. The Star Dish antennas provide a great field performance based on three components. The useful bandwidth of the Star Dish antennas is 800 MHz, giving you enough bandwidth to choose the right channel depending on how crowded the spectrum is. The gain of the Star Dish antennas is stable over the whole bandwidth and equal for both polarizations. So changing the channels or polarizations makes no difference to the signal level and lets you truly leverage all the channels your radio supports. A frequency sweep of the main beam is showing how little the gain changes in every direction. It is also very stable over the whole bandwidth, adding to the stability of the connection the dishes provide. Starter dishes can be readily used with Mimosa and Ubiquiti waveguide radios, making their deployment extremely easy. For universal radio connectivity, use optional Starter Adapter SMA with two female RPSMA connectors that let you connect any radio with coaxial interface. The body and the antenna base of the Starter Dish series is made of steel with protective powder-coated layer of color. The bracket parts are made of extruded aluminum to protect them from oxidizing. The starter dishes will withstand extreme environmental conditions, with temperatures ranging from minus 35 to plus 55 degrees Celsius. Their weight is 1.2, 1.5 and 2.1 kilograms. The mounting of the starter dish is a simple U-bolt bracket for quick and easy deployment. The U-bolt nuts have black colored anti-friction surface coating, protecting them from seizing and making the bracket easy to reuse. If you want to know more about the coating itself, check our short video. When the pole diameter is smaller than 39 mm, use the smaller bracket to install the antenna. If the pole diameter is bigger than 39 mm, use the large one to mount it firmly. Once the antenna is aimed and the tilt adjusted, you can install the radio and you're ready to go. Unstable throughput or jumping modulation rates are but a few symptoms of a wireless network suffering from high interference. With RF elements antennas, you reject noise, save spectrum and grow smart.